as I'm sitting and I'm looking through all these memories of our trips last fall, last fall, and over the last two years, we've had a really great time. I have, Becky. And Those trips mean a lot. They really do. I have, have an idea. Let's take another trip. It's time for another trip. It is. It's Where should we go? Hmm. The world is open to yes. us. And there is nothing more fun than traveling and learning. I agree. So let's look at our atlas. Where should we go? I think we should probably go right here. To, to Athens. We're going back to Athens. I, that would be great. I love Athens. Where should we stay? Let's stay at the Classic Center of the Hyatt. Oh, that would be nice. We haven't stayed at the Hyatt before. We haven't. I so think a new experience for Really. Us. I have our yeah. passports ready. ready to go. Our bags are packed. Our bags are packed, and we are ready to make memories to GFWC. Yes. August the 17th through the 19th. 19th. Let's, let's go see what we're going to learn. Woo! We're ready for our road trip. I'm ready. Here we go. Here we go. We're so excited. I can't wait to get to Institute this Me year. Me either. It really is going to be a trip of a lifetime. I think it is. We're ready. We got our passports. We do. And you know, our members are going to be so excited about how much they're going to learn this year. I think we should probably show them some of the things that I we're talking about. That's a great idea. Let's do it. Let's do it. Here Hold we on. go. Hold on. We're back again on our journey. That's right. And we're going to really, really tone in and hone in on membership. That's right. I even have my tool bag with me today. We have our hard hats, our safety goggles, mm -hmm. ready to dig in. That's right. right. We are ready to build membership across GFWC Georgia. And at Institute, you're going to learn some really good tips of the trade. That's right. One of our goals is increase your membership by 10%. 10%. And you'll have the tools to be able to do that learning at Institute. That's right. Becky, you know, one of the things about Institute this year is it's going to be different. And I think women are going to like this because we always like to do projects. Mm -hmm. And so it's all going to be project based. So you're going to go to this marketplace and learn from all of these expert women in our own federation and some guests about some projects you can take back on Monday. I think that's going to be great. Isn't that great? I always love to go to Institute to learn new things to yes. take back. And so. that's what trips are about is learning something yes. new. So I think about whether it's heifer or a shoebox for our Christmas Operation, Operation Christmas Child or, or Red, Red Nose, Nose Day. Day. You'll learn some fabulous things. <clears throat> Well, well, we're back. We're back. And I'm so excited because public issues actually is where my special project falls, mm -hmm. Girl Scouts. And who can't identify with Girl Scouts? Absolutely. I can't pass one up the, and not buy some cookies. cookies. And these, these are great. And you'll learn some wonderful tips about how to support your local troops. Mm -hmm. Not only Girl Scout troops, but our military as well. Absolutely. Absolutely. Support our veterans, adopt a veteran, adopt a woman of valor to help those that are helping our veterans. Mm -hmm. Get out and vote. This is a voting year. It's going to be important to get out and register people to vote. So these are projects that you'll take back to your club and your communities. Becky and I have a friend. Yes, we do. We're so, we excited, so excited about her. And that's the other thing is bring a friend to Institute. You mm -hmm. may come to Institute all the time, but bring someone who hasn't or hasn't been in a while and mm -hmm. let them learn about some of these great, great projects to take back to our communities. Absolutely. Our friend it's Gia, Gia will be with us on our journey. Can't wait for you to see her adventures. Oh, and conservation. What wonderful things we can do and learn in conservation. Conservation, Absolutely. And Becky has this wonderful project that she's told me about. Tell me about this project, Becky. This is where blankets are made out of plastic recyclable bags. How cool is that? And it's awesome. And you can take them, knit them together, crochet, and then turn around and put them together for a homeless person to sleep on. Oh, wow. So a lot of recycling projects. And I know mm -hmm. our conservation chairs are going to have some really great information Absolutely. for us. 
Absolutely. Us. Can't wait to hear about native plants. Can't wait to hear more about recycling. It'll be a really, really great booth for you to visit. Right. Not including our pet shelters. Oh, that's right. Yes. Go and see conservation. Absolutely. We're back. We're back. <laughs> And it's education time. That's right. Yes. So who doesn't love a good book and always an animal to go with it? Yes. We want to challenge you to get out and to read to children in their schools and to also visit your libraries and do the same thing. And be a part of ESO programs. You That's know, we right. all love to read. So this is a great way to show how much you love to read right. and be able to do that. And what's the blanket, Becky? The blanket is for people with disabilities to have to fine-tune their motor skills. So these are great little things that can be made awesome. and for people just to sit and, and help them with their skills. And you know, Becky, that's one of the things about Institute. I did challenge the CSPs to have hands-on activities. Mm -hmm. So when you go around to the booth and the, um, you'll go to a different one, you may go up to education, you're going to actually have a hands-on activity right. that you're going to do and be able to take back to your club. It's really a neat experience. It's right. going to be very hands-on. Um, the other piece I want to mention that that goes along somewhat with education, but our domestic violence um, program is going to have our special project that we're going to, service project we're going to do at Institute, and that's bringing school supplies. So bring school supplies to Institute, and we're going to turn around and give those school supplies back to shelters um, and for children who are in foster care throughout our different districts. Can't wait to see how many school supplies we bring to help those who are less fortunate, because that's what we do. That's a great, great idea. Great I'm project. super excited about Me that. Me too. We're back again. That's right. One of my favorites is art. art art and we'll be able to do some great hands-on art things i know that our csps are inviting is one of my former high school students oh how exciting that is that exciting? and she is going to um do some artwork with our ladies and i know that you will love her she is precious the other thing and it's a little bit i wanted to be a secret is another one of my students might have a performance for us Ooh. so we might be really really supporting some of our young ladies and um, mm -hmm. building some leadership with even some of our art as that's well that's exciting that's so exciting can't wait for you to do some hands-on artwork that's right and now for home life one of our biggest mm -hmm. biggest programs absolutely absolutely everyone loves a puppy right yes. canines for companions yeah. are a big project and everyone loves a dog so that's one of the things that we'll have at institute and there's going to be some other things that it's going to be very different and unusual, very hands-on. So whether it's the learning a personal safety move, mm -hmm. whether maybe we'll be doing some other fun things. Like uh, yoga. Maybe yoga, we never know. <laughs> or whether it's about learning about your own body and taking care of yourself. Or... It's Ronald McDonald House. That's right. So many things in home life that you're going to be so excited to be able to go and visit and do some hands-on projects. That's and right. take those things back to your club. That's right. Absolutely. We're super excited about yes. home life. And Becky, tell us about your special project because I know it falls under home life. It does. It's about women's health and really taking care of yourself and how to do that with a specialty in diabetes. I really like that. It's very personal to me um, it, with my, my own family. Um, and mm -hmm. so I'm, I'm glad we're supporting something that means a lot to a lot of different people. It does to me as well. I have several in my family that are diabetic. So I think it's... And you know, Institute would not be Institute without Tallul Tallulah Falls School. That's right. They are a big, big part of GFWC Georgia. And so I can't wait to tee off for Tallulah. Can't wait to get more information from our um, TFS friends about how we can support um, their golf program and cannot mm -hmm. wait to see some of the fun games that you're gonna be enjoying at Institute um, to support Tallulah Falls School. And my special project is the ice cream machine. Yum. I know. Swirl it up. Oh, I love it. Yeah. So that will be something we're supporting as the junior conference. Great. Super excited about Tallulah Falls, and we're going to encourage you 
to even come and visit us there. Yes, we want you to be at Tallulah Falls School. We want mm -hmm. you to see what a wonderful state office we have. So mm -hmm. make plans to visit Tallulah Falls School. Make plans to be at Institute to learn more about our special projects. That's right. And Becky, what would Institute not be without some shopping? That's right. Yeah. So be sure and bring your money, not just your fives and your tens, but your fifties and hundreds to shop at Institute. Great vendors, great, great stuff, and great fun. Woo! <laughs> Becky, this has been a trip of a lifetime. It really has. It's it been has. awesome. So get your passports ready and pack your bags and come to Institute August the 17th through the 19th. Ready? Yeah.